Okay, I'm going to try one more run, I think, but also I want to turn up the music and turn off the voices, because this is how I like doing runs now, and I forgot to do that last time. Okay. One stretch real quick. So you know what I'm going to stand up to, because I haven't done that since I started streaming like an hour and a half ago. One second. I'm just gonna, gonna walk around for a minute. Yeah. My cat does not understand why I stood up. <clears throat> Okay. Let's go, better run. <clears throat> if you do find a way to watch the original series, I recommend it. It was pretty good. The first season was a little mediocre, but after that it starts getting really good. If you ever uh, have the chance to watch the sequel series on Netflix, uh, boy is that a weird one to talk about. It's in that weird place where I wouldn't recommend that you watch it unless you saw the original series. Uh, but also, if you saw the original series, you might just hate it, because it's nothing like it. Just another second. Yeah, I should be good now. Kill me. Okay, a few seconds here and it should spawn. I don't need the mortar, that's fine. I should probably properly route this level sometime so that I, uh... I don't even bother going for the mortar. I suspect I'm losing, like, a second or two doing that. there any games I run that might work well in a speedrun bingo format? Spyro 2 actually has a really good bingo, uh, but I'm not very good at it. Bregerman and I did a round of that once, it was fun. Um, we made an N++ bingo board, but nobody ever used it. I think like Pepsi and I did one or two bingo rounds of that, but it, uh, we really didn't have enough goals to make it work well, and nobody could seem to agree on making more, so it kind of died. Uh oh, get up there, Bob. Bob, don't die. That's a weird thing with the turrets in this, where sometimes they will just slaughter you. Like, they just lock on in and will not stop until you're dead. Other times, they can't hit you at all. They just keep missing. Um, you know what? I'm gonna get this tear. I'm gonna get this tear real quick. Got it at 324. If I come up here and die right around now. Yeah, okay. Cool, cool, cool. That should work out fine. That freaked me out because I usually like to have the blaster upgrade already, but uh, I don't think it really matters. 
I can kill those guys with the second level pistol pretty fast anyway. Um, other than that, not so much. We've talked about Spyro 1 bingo before, but it wouldn't be as interesting as Spyro 2. Spyro 3 bingo could also theoretically exist, but it would be weird. Because, like, Spyro 2, you can jump to the end of the game really quickly. Uh, Spyro 3, you can go to the end of the game fairly quickly, but it still takes, like, 20 minutes. Another speedrun categories do not suck at it. Yeah, that makes sense. Get away from me, boxes. Don't shit! There was one right on the ground there! Why weren't you aiming at that? <laughs> the auto aim in this is so dumb sometimes. Dumb in the funniest way. Like, it's not like I'm at risk of dying right now, but still. Oof. I wonder if Pac-Man World could have a bingo. Since you can jump to any world immediately. But you need... I just don't know what the goals would be exactly. Like, collect the Pac-Man letters on level whatever. Complete the maze on some level. Have to be things like that, I guess. I don't know, that could potentially be fun. For some people. I don't actually like... Pac-Man mazes, so... I don't know that I would be so on board with all of the goals. Ooh, ooh, don't fall, please. Bob. Bob, I just asked you not to fall. God damn it. That kind of ruins a lot. No, I guess it doesn't ruin much. It would work well. I don't know. Yeah. Because the, the main question is, like, you know, where can you get to? How quickly can you get to places? As well as, you know, how many different kinds of goals could you have? Okay, hold on, that was at 43, so at 55 I'm going to shoot this thing. If I didn't fall earlier, I wouldn't have to go all this way around. And yeah, I also really need to make that jump to the mortar, so... This is gonna be something. Cool. Okay, squid face, where are you? There you are. Hell yeah! And I have like 20 seconds to go get the light. That's about as well as that squid face fight can go. <laughs> and then it should spawn right now. There it is. Reboot bingo could be fun. You know, mend the tears in level 13. Grab the blaster upgrade in level 5. I don't know. I think there are options. Hey, did the level pretty well. about spy versus spy bingo. 
No, because you already basically do everything in every level. Maybe not story mode, but there might be other game mode things you could, uh, you could try. But I'm not that familiar with the rest of the game to be able to really comment on that. Oh my god, Bob, stop bumping into every wall. You already barely make this as it is. Yeah, a little glob there. Series of unfortunate events, bingo, and play with bagel. Although that would require me to actually, you know, play that game. I still don't know when I'm gonna get around to doing that. The idea has been discussed for a Jersey Devil bingo, but I think it would basically just sort of work as an in-between between, between um, all levels and 100%. Since the levels for that are so long, it's not like you can rush over to some objective in some level, you know. You need to actually play through the whole thing pretty much anyway. So I think it'd be something like, um, that car just flew through that building in the background. Did you guys see that? <laughs> um, you know, like, on this level, get all the nitro crates, but on this level, get all of the, uh, the hostages or something like that, I don't know. Hey. Very tempted to pick it up, only to... See if you can find any routing improvements for Craig. Yeah. I think it could be fun. Good jump? Good jump, okay. <laughs> Wasn't actually sure there for a second. I wish turning off the voices also turned off all the vid windows. Not the, uh, like the ones you use to go through levels, but like the ones that people use to talk to you. those can get problematic. Like, I I wait back here uh, to avoid starting a vid window because it delays spawning the tear. And it'd be nice if I could just start over next to tear. As an example. But also, they just like the game a lot. I make this? I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna do it. No. <laughs> I shouldn't have gone for it. 
I don't think I really lose any time from that since I need to wait for the cycle anyway, but I'm out of ammo now. <laughs> sure if car cycles freeze when you die. Because if they don't, I think I... You know what? Something... A connection might have just been made in my brain about how this game works. Um, I bet levels are only partially loaded at any given time. And cycles stop happening. They just freeze in place when you're away from them far enough. Which is why I keep catching that platform cycle now in level 4, now that I'm using a different route. A cycle that used to be very, very hard for me to catch. That would explain a lot. That would also explain why sometimes that one police vehicle in level 4, uh is where I want it to be, and other times it's not. Interesting. Are there other cycles I can manipulate that way? There aren't that many cycles in the game I deal with, so... I'm really not sure. I wonder if it would be worth saving the mortar for this. Since you can kill Squid Face with the blaster. You don't really need to use it there. But I don't know how much damage the mortar even does to this thing. Because I'm pretty sure some weapons... They don't deal, like, exact amounts of damage. I think there is effectiveness on some weapons. It has seemed as though the blasters do better on the binomes, which are the main, like, guys that go around and zap at you. And rockets seem to do better on turrets, the stationary ones. Ooh, that was a very fast kill. Oh my god, how did I do that so well? Killing it before I got to that next thing I ammo. That's... that's new. Is that new? Have I done that before? I don't think I have. I might have. I might have done that once or twice already. But still, it's not very common at all. So that's pretty neat. You know what might not... <sighs> yeah, see why I want to get rid of the, uh, those vid windows? This would have spawned like four seconds sooner if it wasn't there. Uh, I think it might be worth just unleashing a bunch of rockets in these next couple of rooms to, to de-lag it. Oh, well... I mean, I don't need the ammo anyway, but I wish those rockets homed into a turret and not a guy that it did no damage to. <laughs> oh well. Try to remember that in the future. Might be better to do it here instead. See if I can make this room a little less laggy. Uh, you know what else I'm gonna do while I'm thinking about it is I'm gonna get this tear, and then instead of taking my normal route, I'm gonna start with this key, since I am already down here and facing the way that I would want to go for it. And then I'll try to go up and get this one. 
I have a suspicion this is a better idea, but I'm not positive. But yeah, I mean, like, if I could kill some of the turrets in this room, that would be very beneficial. <sighs> That's not the angle I wanted, though. It's really hard to go up slopes at, uh, and adjust your angle in this. <sighs> Overcompensated after going too high. Third try. Not terrible. Not great, I'm losing time here, but not terrible. Given that I used to think that jump might be impossible. Not bad. Not bad at all. Get the help. Hmm. <laughs> I would have liked that life, but okay. I probably should make different splits for, uh, for playing on PS2. It's gonna kinda stink to see my golds go, but uh, it stinks a lot more to see all these best split times that I know I can't match. time I failed that jump? Maybe. I will grab health and ammo on the way back. What was that cycle? Huh. Bob! Don't get caught up there. Come on, man. I would have liked to grab the health in that, uh, that big room, but I don't think I need it. I think as long as I just mash shots fast enough, I'll be mostly okay. Is health here. Of course, I am also missing all of these cycles this time. Come on, oh, man. Boo. Boo, Bob. No! Oh, no, 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 no. I've done that before, and it scares me so much when it almost happens. Where you jump up there, and the tear's gravitational pull just throws you in a circle around it and back down. It sucks that that can happen, but it is a risk. What? I understand falling off of it, but really, I also didn't get the antivirus? Come on. Come on, game. This is gonna be a really bad split, actually. Like, regardless of the lag, I'm 
just playing pretty poorly. Yeah, this tear got here very quickly. Or rather, I got here very slowly. Why are you jumping over? I still have a theory that uh, if you beat the game and say new game, you're playing on a harder difficulty, just like as a hidden stat somewhere. It's possible that every time I have done more than one run in a row, I'm just playing worse on future runs. But that has been such a consistent problem, I don't know. Like, any time I play this game, the idea of dying because you take so much damage is ridiculous. Nothing in this game is actually that dangerous. But pretty much every time it's happened, it's happened on second runs. Know, it just seems like bullets are more accurate, like the enemy's bullets are more accurate. It's mostly that. Things seem to do about the same damage as normal. But normally when enemies are shooting and all of their shots whiz past me, now all of their shots hit me instead. I'm getting really bad lag spikes here, and it's making it kind of hard to control Bob. Oh god, I hate those turrets. Yeah, this run is dead. With the last level and now falling down there, the, there's not much hope here. <laughs> Don't push me off. bigger time saves in the run.
I believe I still have a pretty big time save on level 15. But, uh, other than that, not so much. And I might as well finish the run. I mean, I need the practice. That was really risky, charging into it like that. That really easily could have killed me. Ooh. Nearly a full second gold. I misread that for a second as minus 0, 0.00, but, uh, no, 0. 0.98, that's great. I didn't think I could do that boss much faster. Okay, now, Kits is not a time save. I actually need to play it with Hulk. I came very close to just jumping off the edge there. Guess I can just ignore that turret then. It's not like I can hit it from there. I kind of would have liked that ammo, but I don't really need it. I would have liked that ammo too, but I think I should still be good. I think there are only a couple of turrets left. And yeah, it would have vanished by now. I wonder if it would be worth dying in this level. You do have to wait a few seconds on the third tear. <laughs> no, because it sends you back so far, I can't imagine the timing could work out at all. Oh, well, maybe. I don't know, I'll look at it at some point. I'm also not married to the idea of uh, doing more death abuses in this run. I'm already running a little low on lives. I don't need that health. I'm fine. So used to actually needing it, but uh, now I'm good right now. Oh man, my cat is very cute. Now, let's see if we can get an angle on her. Well, uh, wait for the tear. There's the cat. Kind of see her.
Oh, good chat. Come on, Bob. Get the important thing. been doing this level so well all of a sudden. Oh, well, I spoke too soon. I spoke way too soon. Come on, come on. Okay, good. Yeah, I don't know what it is. I just... I found some kind of a rhythm there. Oh, this level. Right. Oh, boy. Okay, let's see how it goes. I want to just ignore these first couple of turrets. Should be fine doing that. Cool. One key down. So those are some fairly risky jumps I do, but, uh... Well, they seem to work. The kind of thing where the kind of jump is risky, but I almost never actually miss it there. And when I say the kind of jump, I mean... Like, the kind of jump where you land and then immediately try to jump again? That's usually the kind of thing that gets you killed. Ooh, ooh, okay. Made that. Good. Excellent. Cool, cool. One more. One more path. What? Excuse me, sir? I think you are mistaken. Oh my god. Oh my god, is this it? Is this the perfect floating point park? The park of my dreams. <laughs> the park that only exists in IL Records. That was amazing. Oh my god. I caught every cycle. That was it. That was an enormous gold. Holy shit. The <laughs> I didn't even realize I had that much of a gold left on it. Oh my god. Uh-oh. Big uh-oh. Finish the boss, Bob. Oh, God, okay. Again, still convinced the game gets harder if you do a second run. I was not playing perfectly there, but still. I could 
do with a uh, uh, another means of killing my. Well, no, I really don't. Never mind. I was just thinking the uh, you know the big death tower things really are not a good way to commit suicide in this level, but you also don't need to do it super fast, so not too much of an issue. Here. You can hardly see my cat there, I might as well put that back on me. I need a webcam with a longer uh, cord so I can actually reach it places to make it look at my cat, basically. <laughs> so I want to die at about... 40.05? Oh! I can't die again, or I'm gonna lose. Oops. I guess I wasn't paying that close attention to my lives. Uh, oh well. Let's hope I don't die. <laughs> this run is world record pace, so, uh, that would stink. <laughs> Now, there's another life I can pick up here if I don't mess up the platforming too bad. If I don't mess it up. Like that. Oh, and then I went into an area where I might die. Oh no! And the tear spawned earlier than I... Oh god, guys, this is really bad. I think I messed up everything on this level. Uh, maybe. Maybe. If the tear spawns, like, right now, we're good. But if not... Okay, there it is. Good, good, good. All hope is not lost! Quite. Almost. I gotta make this jump again. This nightmare of a bad jump. Shit. Also, the next two levels, and the bosses, are not free. Guys, I might die and lose the run in a couple levels. I wasn't bad at platforming, I could have grabbed an extra life on the way to the second tear, but oh well. Such is Reboot. Already losing time? No? Yeah, there it goes. Yes, is the answer. Hurry, hurry, hurry. There, extra lives I can pick up in this level. I think there's one? There's one near the last tear, but that's not... That's not that helpful. That's not where I'm at risk of losing in this level. Oh god. It's gonna be hilarious if this run dies. <laughs> After the perfect floating point park. Oh man. I still don't know why I bother shooting at those. I know I'm not going to kill them. Bob, you suck. Bob, you suck! Just get up there! Anyway, yeah, that's the extra life in this level, and it's the last thing I'm gonna grab, so I hope I don't die in the other, uh, the other gears section. I 
haven't in a while, but that's no guarantee. I mean, if I wanted, I guess I could have done the tear first and then come down here, but... You know, that's not interesting. There's the fun in that. Okay, okay. Good, 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 good. I think I'll be fine now. It's possible I'll fuck up and die, but I think I'll be fine. Okay, but actually... Why would you turn?! walls in this game, I swear, they make you turn 180 degrees sometimes. Yeah, losing a lot of time here. This is a really mediocre level. Even going out of my way to get that, uh, that life, that went pretty bad. long time, apparently. Either I did that really fast, or I did something to make that uh, go slower. I guess I did mend the tear pretty fast. Usually takes me a little bit longer than it just did. Well, I never get that because it's so hard to get up here for some reason afterwards. Crap. That's really bad. Like, maybe run ending bad. <laughs> because of that, exactly. Getting to the exit without invincibility is nearly impossible for me. I have technically done it before, I think. Oh, shit, there we go. Okay, okay, I can take that. You know what? That's okay. That's okay. Best possible time, 49.27. It's still possible. Just need to PP by 45 seconds. thing I'm aiming at, but, you know, whatever. Come on, come on, come on, hit him, hit him. Yes, okay, okay. Here we go. That's not bad. 
Last fight, maybe world record. Hexadecimal has been known to screw me before, so we'll see. I just mean this fight is not not exactly free, you know. Oh, that's the kind of thing that makes it not free. Why is she doing that? Why does she only do that sometimes? And that's it. And... 4948 I'd like to thank Floating Point Park for all the work it did on this record. God damn. I am glad I decided to do one more run. I'm glad I decided to keep that run going after, what was it, like level 7 that went really bad? <laughs> oh man. <laughs>